Hey HCD family, it's Mimi. Checking in on my first day of phase three and round two. Uh, it's doing good so far. I had bacon and eggs. Uh, this It was like in the afternoon because I usually don't eat until about 12 or 1230 um, because of my husband and his work schedule. But anyway, I planned on eating actually more pieces of bacon than four pieces, but my son came home early. He worked early and grabbed three pieces. So, as devastating as that was, because thinking, I get to eat bacon. So, um, anyway, I had my four pieces of bacon. I had two eggs. And I've had some nuts. I've actually been munching on nuts for the past couple of days. And I just wanted to report, I had seen uh, in one of Steph Universe, uh, one of her vlogs about um, she, was in, she was in phase two, so this was not the protocol, but anyway, it was her birthday. And uh, she had made this uh, little chocolate mug cake with uh, macadamia nuts and uh, so anyway when I, I watched it and I thought well I thought I'm gonna go ahead and um, I'm just gonna go ahead and make it I hadn't really ate that much I probably ate I had yogurt that day I was trying to eat up all of my uh, zero fat stuff cottage cheese and yogurt and the day before I had ate up my cottage cheese so um, the next day I was going to eat, um, go ahead and eat the uh, yogurt. So I finished up eating the yogurt, which was probably, I made that with blueberries, and it was probably, I'd say about a cup and a half. It was a pretty big, it was a pretty big uh, bowl of uh, no-fat yogurt and berries. And anyway, so that's all I had, and then... I went to the grocery store and I got some nuts. I got some cashews. Um, I'd already had some macadamia nuts here at the house. and But some nuts too for my husband because he likes to have them to snack on. And I, so I ate some cashews. I think I might have had a few mac nuts. And I was watching this vlog that she'd done and about this cake. And I thought, you know, what? I'm going to see, I'm going to make it and just see how it is because it was with chocolate. And, um, so anyway, I made that, and of course she talked about it, that she, she had done it on phase two on her birthday and had sirloin steak um, for lunch and for dinner and had that um, mug cake. <clears throat> so anyway, I had it. Of course, I was full. I didn't add any uh, whipped cream or anything to it. And I ate that, and I got up the next day and had released one point. Eight. So, so the next day, I wasn't very, wasn't very hungry, and I probably was eating like way too many cashews or whatever. But anyway, so I woke up the next day, um, and and was back up to one eighty one. Um. Let's see, that was yesterday. Crap, hold on. You know what? I should be better prepared. But I'm not. My last dose weight was 182.2. Um, May 1st, which was yesterday, 180, okay, 182.2. That was my last dose weight. Um, the next day was 181.2. And, um, which was the same, which is funny, I was 181.4, I was 181.2, I was 181.2, I was 181.8, and at 181.8, April the 30th, that's when I had the, um, chocolate mug cake, and I ate that, and I had the yogurt, and then I woke up the next day, which was yesterday, at, uh, 180. So I had lost 
1.8. But you know how come sometimes we can lose the weight while we're trying to get the HCG out of our system? So, anyway, yesterday, I think I ate, I really was munching too much on nuts. Um, I'm sorry, I tried to stay for it. Paul, did I have? I think I had made some chicken. I think I just ate chicken, a couple pieces of asparagus, and then I had had those cashews and some coffee with whipping cream in it. And so I woke up today, believe it or not, I woke up to one point or 181.8. So I kind of went back up. Um, so but my last dose weight was 182.2. So today, anyway, I got on my fitness pal, which I've never done before. I actually signed up for it back in February, but didn't do it. And uh, I thought, well, you know what? I'm going to try. I'm going to try to be disciplined, kind of make sure that I'm, you know, I'm, I want to make sure I'm getting plenty of protein. I'm getting my fat in, and uh, and 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 finding that a little bit difficult. Uh, I haven't had lunch. I just got done really with dinner because I had the bacon and the eggs. So I actually made 200 grams, 200 grams of chicken breast that I cooked. And I, I did cut the fat off of it. I mean, it was already boneless, skinless. Get some, I get it in the bag at uh, Trader Joe's. And uh, so I thought, here I am cutting this fat off when I don't have to, but for some reason, I just have to. And I feed it to my dog anyway, so he gets a treat. So I've, I didn't eat all of that, but I could not believe how much that extra 100 grams of meat is. It just looks, it looks unbelievable. I mean, it's like, this is a lot of meat. Uh, I didn't have any vegetable. I'm, I might. I haven't had any vegetables today. I might have a salad if I do later on. I mean, it's almost seven o'clock, so I really need. And I'm not just really hungry, but I was planning on making that um, mud cake. I do want to tell you that after I had that mug cake, I woke up the next day and I was in full-blown ketosis, so anyway, just checking in, like I said, I'm on my fitness pal, look me up, it's still Mimi's HCG, and uh, if you want to, you know, if you don't, I understand, a lot of people have a lot of friends out there, and uh, one more is just, because you can't comment, can't be there for everybody. But, so, just, you know, hanging in there and just going to enjoy myself. And uh, there again, I am missing um, some people that I haven't seen in a while. And you know who you are. So, everybody have a uh, rest of the day. Good day. We had a beautiful day here in Kentucky. And I will hope to see you soon. Everybody maintain. Everybody release. Uh, Miss Sandy, I know she's getting ready to load. Woo! Have a good night. Hug to my CG family.